on the railroad. Hi, I'm Sarah with OCTA and this is your Transportation in Two. Just earlier this year, the Orange County Transportation Authority completed construction on an $85 million project to enhance the safety at 52 railroad crossings, just like this one, throughout our county. With new and improved signs, signals, and gates, these safety features allowed the communities along our rail corridor to establish quiet zones, which further enhanced the quality of life for our Orange County residents. Yeah, and we see uh, passenger rail playing a much more significant role in Orange County's future. The expansion of Metrolink, the Amtrak service is very valuable to us here in the county, so it only seemed appropriate that as part of Measure M2 we would focus on rail safety. Um, as we look at uh, the interfaces that the rail corridor has each and every day with vehicles, with pedestrians, with bicyclists, it was very evident to us that we needed to do something. Um, so what we did was take a comprehensive approach and look at all 52 crossings in the county and really look at what we could do to improve safety um, at each and every one of those crossings and each one has an individual uh, focused area. In some areas we had raised medians, we relocated driveways, we put in four quadrant gates, we put in pedestrian gates, bells, lights, flashers, better and improved signage and really looking at it uh, across the county. The added benefit is that each of the nine cities in Orange County that this program impacts can declare quiet zones or apply for quiet zones through the Federal Railroad Administration. Paving the way for the future, this program is the first of its kind in the nation, generating a lot of buzz in the engineering world, as it was awarded Engineering Project Achievement Award by the Orange County Engineering Council. Congratulations to OCTA and everyone involved. For more information on Quiet Zones, please visit octa.net slash quietzones.